The Young Heroes program has got children in primary schools out on the fields doing structured exercise. The aim of the project is to develop a passion for regular exercise amongst young children and to create opportunities for them to participate in physical activities at school. The objectives of the Heroes program has been supported by so much academic research and the statistics that are out there regarding sedentary behaviour and a lack of physical activity. Um, hinging the Heroes program onto movements like the VUCA South Africa Move for Your Health campaign, uh, the Charter for Youth Physical Activity and Sport and Play um, has really poised, poised it in a, in a very important sector of social responsibility within South Africa. Physical education is almost defunct at some schools and many do not have the necessary expertise or equipment to offer any form of exercise or sporting activity for children. There are many advantages to a healthy and fit child and many schools have reported benefits such as increased concentration in the classroom as well as an increase in children participating in sport at the schools. It's really different from just doing work at school. It's now you want to come to school, you want to be in school, you just don't want to say, okay, I'm here now, I want to go away, I want to stay in school because I'm having lots of fun. I'm not just, you know, sitting around riding and getting bored. Education is, is important, but I think the sport uh, part as well, it, it's got to be introduced to, to kids. And, and the more you do it, the, the more active you become. I think it's very, very important for the development, especially as a, at a young age. Um, to make it also part of your, of your life, um, not just on a healthy um, sense, but also on the other hand, um, keeping you busy and keeping you active. Our focus is to transfer skills to educators and over a period of one term, educators are able to continue the program in their schools. A comprehensive program that includes practical and theoretical transfer of skills to educators is delivered at schools that have the facility to accommodate the program. Schools with very limited space are chosen to receive the free play concept, where physical education is done on a board attached to a wall at the school. The free play concept also encourages certain academic development in children whilst they play on the free play wall. It also incorporates teaming. Both implementation methods include a donation to the schools of the necessary equipment needed to continue the program after our exit from the schools. The greatest positive spin-offs we can have out of a project like this is changing mindsets and, and creating a sense of value in the youth uh, by, by an organisation like the Red Cap Foundation coming into a school, showing the, the youth that they're interested in their progress and showing them that there's, there is a bigger and brighter future in South Africa. It really helps to, to create the future we're looking for. Sport can play a vital important role in, in this uh, country and the development of this country and the more kids you get involved in those things, I think the better future we'll, we'll have as well. I think kids are the future of this country and we need to treasure that a, a lot more than what we're doing now.